Hey everybody, it's your old buddy Nate Trier coming at you again with another tutorial Tuesday. And today I want to talk about some of the production techniques I used in my most recent single, Leviathan's Fishhook. And those techniques were, one, I supplemented the sound of acoustic instruments with their cheesy electronic counterparts. Two, I supplemented the sound of an acoustic instrument with a sound that was not even a musical sound. And three, I treated the accordion by adding saturation and messing with its harmonics. Number one, when I was making a demo, I used synthetic brass sounds to kind of figure out the part for the baritone horns. I re-recorded that using a real instrument, but then I decided I actually liked the sound of the real instruments supplemented by the synthetic instruments. So here's the real horns. And these are the synthetic horns. The combined effect is subtle, but it really does add something, and if you take away one or the other, it doesn't really sound the same. Likewise, it took the sound of a tuba. And added the sound of my cat's water fountain, but you're probably going to need headphones to hear it. And again, this is a really subtle thing, but if you take away one or the other, it just doesn't sound the same. And then for the accordion, which is always hard to mix because of the way the harmonics work, I used uh, some advice I got from Adam Matlock, and I added just a touch of Saturator from Sound Toys' Decapitator plugin. And I was very happy with how it sounded. Hope that sounds interesting. If you haven't listened to it yet, you can find Leviathan's Fishhook on Spotify and on YouTube. And I have a new single coming out at the end of the month that's going to be part of a new EP, which will all also be released as part of a book with sheet music and pictures and poetry that I'm super excited about. And I'll be talking a lot more about it in the upcoming couple of weeks. See you then.